So they made you stick your tongue to a frozen flagpole? Ah, that's nothing. Look what they did to me. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay, stupid jokes aside, this has been f this is Future Future Five. We're back with more Paper Mario time out of your door, and ah, oh, it's Bobbery. Welcome back to you. Do you know how worried we were? My stomach has been most upset. I must worry about everyone here. But who worries for Flavio? No one. Well, you're just sitting here drinking tea. Ugh. Do you know how hard how hard that is for me to sit here at safety and worry so much? Incredibly. I do not know what in I do not know what is out there waiting to lurch and snack upon me. We do not even know how to get home for the sake of the blue briny sea. But no but no more yelling. Now is the time to pull together and work as a team. Flavio boy, I must say, you talk rather too much. Such insolence! Grrr. I growl at you like an angry jungle beast. I ought to. So, in any case, Mario, about that crystal star you spoke of earlier, there was rather odd rock in the far east of the jungle with a skull carved into it. Call it an old sea bomb's intuition, but that skull rock smells suspicious. <laughs> hey, Bobber, do you want to know what really smells suspicious? Arm. Oh, it smells like low tide. Oh, ha, ha, ha. But seriously, if you didn't, if you weren't able to read that, it said Flavio's armpit. You mean, you may be onto something with that skull rock. I say that's where the treasure is. Well, anyone can figure that out, you mutinous joker. I mean, how obvious. I was already saying that in my head that the treasure is certainly behind that rock. And, and as such, I will continue the noble duty of protecting this camp from invasion. Get them, Mario. Carry on. I am sorry to make so many requests, but you know... Flavio, you old crash cash grabber. If you want a treasure, why don't you get it yourself? Oh, well. Yes, uh, Admiral. You see, I, uh... Um... Well, yes, you have a point. Let's decide this fair and square, shall we? Listen to me, everyone. Who thinks I should go along to investigate, investigate the Skull Rock? Oh, heck yes! Take him, please! Have fun out there, you jerk! Off with you! There you have it, Flavio. Fair and square. A what? Um, no. Not fair. Flavio hates you all! Flavio will join you for a short time. Even if you have another partner out, Bobbery will automatically come out and uh, start this little exchange. So, um... Is there something else I want to say? Oh, I guess not. So I'll meet you guys over at, um, the Skull Rock. Okay, be right back. Hello everyone, we're back with more Paper Mario Towers to your door. And, um... Let's see, where was I? Oh yes, here we are. We're about to enter the next part. Uh, a little... Oh yeah, by the way, I wanted to show this. Is that cruel or what? I am such a jerk. You too, Flavio. Jeez. Alright, so anyway, we just come over here and... Hmm, is this the rock Bobber was talking about? Ah, what is all this? A dead end. Taunting Flavio is dead end -ness. But, hmm, is this... I think this is the rock Bobber blabbered about. Well, it possibly reeks of ancient secrets, yes? Let us plunge into this puzzle. And by let us plunge into this puzzle, he means let us do it. Yeah. Anyway, there should be a, yep, there's a star piece right here, by the way. That means three one. Okay. Um, so first thing we ought to do is examine it, of course. A large stone blocks away. It seems to be carved into the shape of a skull. There is a space in in one of the eyes where you can conceivably place something. Hey Gonzalez, doesn't Flavio have a chin that might fit in that eye hole? Oh yeah, the big red gem that he has since the beginning of the game. So, here we are. He's gonna sing the song again. Skull Captain casts his gaze. Red jewels shine in the blade. Boom pops boom festival. The Stash Brothers' best of friends. Three times red stash lands on his end. Blue pass, blue stash his belly. Four times it's whacked. Let's hear those fireworks go boom at the boom pops the boom festival. Am I just seeing? I am just seeing a wild way to time. It's not like Fabio is scared or anything. But do you know something? I have never been able to know that song's meaning. Hmm. Actually, that song is relevant now, but... Anyway, focus. What is... What is it you ask of me? You want Flavio to lend you something. Is this correct? Now, what could I possibly have that you would need with such anxiousness? Um... The, the only right choice is Skull Jam, but if you... If you, if you select the others, it, it'll just make you a short joke, and you'll choose... Uh, you know, pick again. So, what? You want me to lend you the Skull Jam? You really, really need it? This is the heirloom of the house of Flavio, you know? But I suppose it is all right because I am Flavio. He has such ludicrous wealth. I am just lending it, though. Do not dare run off with it. Don't make me dock pay. Wait, we're getting we're getting paid. 
Awesome! Today just rocked all of a sudden. Alright, so come over here and place the skull gem. Let me send a skull rock. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so do this four times. One, two. Oh, wait, no, it's only three times. This is four times. That was kind of weird. Mario just barely lifted up his head and still connected. Okay, let's see. What, wait, what's going on? Uh oh. So we throw this old guy in here. <laughs> awesome. That's just awesome. Okay. Come on, Bobbery. Do your job. That boy. Hallelujah! The, the way has opened. Oh, such excitement! The cave entrance. Hmm? Huh? W wait, what? Uh, my skull gem! M -m Mario, what were you thinking? That gem was part of the house of Flavio! Phew! Oh, what a happy day. I have my skull gym back. My jolliness has no end. Uh, um, um, now then, I'm sure you're all disappointed, but Folio must be heading back now. Oh, really? Ah, uh, I miss you already. Yeah, I cannot let those back in the camp worry about me further. You do understand, yes? No. So, let me know when you find that glittery treasure, alright? Ah, uh, of course. Oh, well, we're getting paid, right? Right? Right! No, I'm just kidding. Anyway, so let's go ahead and enter. Um, it's, it's coffee in danger, my brave explorers enter. Uh, here's a little glitch I encounter every time, from time to time. The star next to the text messages disappears. I'm not sure if it's, if it's my disc or, uh, it's just, just my disc or whatever, but it becomes transparent. You can see the background whenever that happens. Anyway, I'm scoffing in danger my brave explorers entered the cave. Will they, act, act, will they actually find the Pirate King's treasure? I tremble with anticipation. And so here we are, inside a Pirate's Grotto. And I think if you... Ruin Powder. That can be a good item. It confuses enemies, which is good. I'm not sure if I want to... Throw out one of my other items for it, though. Uh... Nah, I won't. Yeah, okay. Goodbye, Ruin Power. Although that will become be important in some dishes later, so... But we'll, we'll get to a shop that sells it, so uh, we won't worry about it. Uh, oh, whoops, no. Nope, nope, better not, right in the middle of the video. Uh, let's see, let's see, so let's continue on. Soldier on! Ooh! Ooh! So scary. They have the budget of my high school, that drama class. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, whoa, glitch! Bobbery fell right through the floor. Huh. Anyway, so... Okay, so that's just the beginning of, the, of this little mini dungeon here. And... Take you out. Let me be able to go a little bit farther in this video. Oh, whoops. Ah, shoot, this is new in there. I was thinking of the blue ember. Shoot. Oh, I... Lava bubble. Okay. I'm not sure why there's a lava bubble in here. We're in the middle, middle of the... Uh-oh. Two poison shrooms, just what I need. Ah, shoot! Oh, this is, I know where this is gonna hit, where this is going. So, okay. That this guy again, hopefully I won't get in trouble. Oh, no! You're kidding me! Well, it's always gonna happen sooner or later, so I'm glad I got it out of the way now. So that's what happens when you get two poison mushrooms. Luckily, your audience comes back fairly quick. And they'll be mostly, uh, back when during the next battle anyway. That's a level bubble. It's a flame spirit. Max HP is 6, attack is 4, and defense is 0. This HP and attack power may be different from embers, but otherwise it's the same. Since, it's made, since, since it is made of fire, try not to touch it because it'll burn you. Apparently, it's vulnerable to explosion sized attacks. Oh, and if you get hit by a flame attack, you might catch fire, so guard well. Yeah, I should have. Ah. Well, I was trying to super guard against it, but. Guess that didn't work! Okay. So, there we go. Man, that was embarrassing. Luckily, I'm close to level up, so it's not all bad. Oh, that's weird. Anyway, um, I think that'll do it for this video, and we'll continue exploring the Pirate Scroto next time. Those so, things, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you then. Okay, bye.